to Feeding Life Worldwide, BRW, Living Life as the Creator Demand. We are in the series of what God expects from us as Christians. That simple uh, thing God expects from us. Because of some of us, we don't know. That is why we are struggling with our Christian life. But today as you are ending it, and I know that you will know how God expects us to serve Him and your life will never be the same. Let's continue. I ended at uh, where we need to serve God with all thy heart. As I was explaining, you know, if you fear God, if you serve God with all your heart, you will not choose your education, your business, your lifetime, whatever it is, the worldly things are ahead of what God. I didn't say that you should not learn, you should not go to business, you should not sell, you should not do that, no. But the thing is, you balance your life. How do you balance your life? You have time to serve God, right? You need to, if you know that you go to work so early, as early as 5 a.m., then we need to wake up at 4 a.m. To read your Bible, to pray to God, to guide you, to serve you. You know, you need to balance your life out. How do you balance your life again? Now you check it out. Um, when you you have to go to church, there's time for you to go to church. And somebody's uh, have called you, I want to buy this. Ah, will you open the shop? But it's time for sale. You can't you tell the person that oh, I have a meeting now, so don't worry. When uh, when I finish, I'll call you, I'm going to church, and it's time. You don't choose your you don't choose your destiny, your business ahead of God. When it's time for business, you run to business. Is that not this? So same as when it is time for church, when it's time for activities of God, like going out to preach the gospel, going to church, you know, anything around God, you balance it up. You understand? So that you don't intertwine your your Christianity with what with your secular what, life. Make sure that you balance your Christian life with your what, with your secular life. So that one will not when it is balanced as an example, when this thing is balanced, when I leave it, it will not fall. But when it's not balanced and it's like this, one side is growing, one side is not growing. So when I leave it, it will fall. You understand? So you need to balance it so that they will all be equal. As we learn in what equilibrium, they should be what equal, equal what form, so that they will not be what shaking. Your Christian life will not what be shaking. And I know that you'll be doing so. Before I end it, let's look at Exodus twenty, Exodus twenty-three, verse twenty-five, and he said, "And ye shall serve the Lord your God, and He shall bless thy bread." And thy water, and I will take sickness away from the midst of thee. Hallelujah. God said, When you serve the Lord thy God with all your heart, He, he will bless your bread. What is your bread? Your, your daily bread. That's what your food, eating, your money, your business. That is your bread. You know, everything that brings you money, that brings you food, that is your bread. So when you serve the Lord with the thy God with all your heart, with everything of you. He will bless your businesses. He will bless your education. He will make sure every time there will be money, anything that will bring you money will come through him. And so he will bless your bread and what? And your water. So these are your bread and water. And under that one, he shall take sicknesses what? Away from you. What are the sicknesses? The sicknesses are what? The fighting of the devil. When the devil start to fight against you, when the demons try, the witches and the wizards try to fight against you, Almighty God will stand in to fight for you. When you pray to him, you will hear your prayers and he will listen to you. So my beloved brethren and sisters, these are the simplest things God entreat us to do. This is what he needs from us, you and me. I've told you and let us know that Christianity is not a joke. It is meant for business, it's for seriousness, not on serious people, not people who are in for their materialistic things, but people who are ready to serve God and to go to heaven. In our next episode, we are going to learn so many things that we need to know as people and as a Christian. And I believe that by the time we finish all this series, you and me will learn a lot from it. And our life will never be the same. My name is William. This is BLW, Building Life Worldwide. Please follow all our, our social media channels on YouTube, Building Life Worldwide. On Instagram, Building Life underscore, Building underscore Life underscore Worldwide. On our Facebook page, Building Life Worldwide on Facebook, and you got to have all these messages. Share, like, subscribe, and comment. God bless you. Bye bye.